Hi, good day. I'm going to show you what you have to do if you've lost your key for your safe. Unfortunately, I've lost my key, but I'm lucky because the lock was still open. So, first of all, you can see the, the door is open. Hooray. Okay, so you just have to lift this door off its hinges. And I'll just put it on the ground. And I'll show you the tools that I used. I've already loosened some of the bolts and um, I just have some screwdrivers here, flat screwdrivers, a hammer, a shifting spanner and a small flat screwdriver. I'll show you what I used that for. Um, let me just put the door on top here and I can show you. Um, you can see I've already loosened the bolts but some of them are still gripping. This one came out easily. This one still needs to so I'm using a shifting spanner to loosen this bolt. Okay. Okay, that one's out. Okay, I've got the four bolts off. Now I can take this panel off side okay inside you can see that I've okay I've loosened this main bolt and um, this is the lock section where the key goes from the front it goes in and this this section contains the lock itself um, I'll just show you I'll demonstrate to you how the, the lock actually functions that uh, spinning handle in the front when you turn it, 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 this is how it locks, and this is how you open the, so it locks, and then it opens. Now, when you lock it, and then you turn the key, the, the lock actually comes out here, and blocks this thing from going back. So, that, that's how this lock mechanism works. Okay, so let me continue. Um, as I said earlier, I'll tell you what, I use the small screwdriver to remove this plastic stopper. This stopper prevents this lock mechanism from coming out or slipping out. It, it holds it in place. So I use this little screwdriver to kind of lift it and wiggle it out. I've already done that, but you can see it's just a little plastic stopper. Okay. Um, the bolt I've already loosened, so I'll just remove that. Okay, and then I have to take the lock mechanism out. Very simple, you just pull it back and you lift it. And there you go, this is, this is the mechanism. Okay, now to take the lock section out, let's just get a screwdriver and the hammer. Put it underneath, we'll just get it out. Okay, so you need a screwdriver and a hammer. And Basically, you must just knock the lock out of its holder. Just complete that quickly. Okay, you can see it came out fairly simple. Okay, so now I've got this lock mechanism and I'm going to just open it. So you can see what it looks like inside. Um, I might get a key made for it or maybe replace the entire lock itself. Now let's just loosen these screws, take them out. That's one. Now when you open a lock be very careful because sometimes there are springs that are inside and something might shoot out or something might go so you just be very careful when you open it now oh, there we go you, see, you can see that the one one part actually came loose 